your thing and your own what you say yeah i'd be proud of you hey you guys and welcome to a brand new video slash vlog i'm really aka really me for those who don't know and if it's your first time here welcome to my channel if it's not your first time here and you're returning for whatever amount of times you've been here before thank you for coming back and staying sticking around with me i'm so glad that you're still here and the reason why I say this is a vlog and new video is for the simple fact that I went to Atlanta Pride 2019, October 12th and 13th, and I tried to vlog, but it didn't happen the way I wanted to because Sunday it rained during the parade, and on Friday, no, not Friday, Saturday, I kept... Saturday I didn't record much, but I took a lot of pictures and stuff like that, so yeah. But I did get a little recorded in, so yeah. That's the reason why this is going to be a vlog in the new video, because I'm actually going to also show you guys what I got while I was at Pride. And another thing I'm going to do is tell you guys about my experience at Pride, because it was an amazing experience on so many freaking levels. It was so freaking amazing. Both days, the whole entire weekend, the performances, the meet me then Dinah Jane. Oh, did I tell you guys I was going to be Dinah Jane in the last video? I don't think. I don't remember if I did. No, I definitely didn't tell y'all, but guess what? I met Dinah Jane, and that was an amazing experience, even though it was raining and my hair got poofy, which I didn't like, but... I look okay right now so I'm happy okay so you guys this is one of the things I got I don't know if y'all can see the whole thing hopefully y'all can see it it's a rainbow flag and it says crime crime stoppers greater Atlanta and yeah stop crime uh, ATL wait stop crime ATL.com that's one of the things I got during the actual pride parade that happened that Sunday on the 13th um, I also got this 2019 Pride Parade on Peachtree TV CBS 46 bag that I didn't put to use because I don't know why. Um, and I just wanted to get those two out of the way so I don't forget because, yeah, they're going on the floor. But the Pride... Atlanta Pride this year was so amazing. We had performances from Matt's for the, like the second or third time. Um, Kesha performed. She closed out the whole entire. She closed out. Well, she kind of closed out. Power night. Power. I don't remember their name, but Power ATL um, performances, and she did amazing. She did to top last. I was so happy, and yeah, even though. I'm, I'm gonna get to, to that later what happened. Um, Allie Brooke performed. I didn't really like her performance. I'm sorry for any of those who's watching who likes Allie's new music, but her performance wasn't that amazing. Like, I hope. Like, I like her song Low Key, kind of. And I like her song Perfect, she did with somebody, I can't remember their name. But other than that, I don't really like her like that because um, I don't know. I just. Um, who else performed? This girl named Nikki N I K I performed. AJ Mitchell performed again for the second time, cause I think he performed last year or the year before last. I think it was last year though. Um, Donna Jane of course performed. She performed on Sunday. Um, on the thirteenth, on Sunday the thirteenth, and yeah, everybody was um, everybody was good. Everybody was amazing. Um, I had a few drinks. I'm not gonna lie, I had a few drinks because I was VIP. Like, again, VIP, I have actually have two of these. V I Atlanta Pride VIP Weekend 2019 VIP pa Festival Pass. Hashtag Atlanta Pride. I didn't take a picture with this. I might take a picture of this today. Um, I got some really cool stuff. I got these glasses that I'm probably not gonna wear because I really don't wear shades like that. Oh, here you go. Here goes the Pride map. Um, Cash is on it. Donna Jane, Ali Brooke, DJ Mary Mac. Daya, Daya performed. Daya, I, I knew I was getting somebody who performed that I really wanted to see. 
Daya performed. She did amazing. I love Daya's music. Yeah, that's all the people I actually like wanted to see that perform. But yeah, this year there was there was a couple praise. I don't remember how many. But um, what I was happy about was that this year marked the first annual buy in pen parade because. Elena has never done it before and hopefully next year they do another one and they keep it up the tradition and they keep doing the tradition like they do with trans marches and all this other stuff because the Bipan march was amazing. Like it was amazing. Everybody was together, everybody was walking. We had to walk the pathway to get to the Coca-Cola stage instead of the streetway. On our way to where the Coca-Cola stage was in the back of the park. We had, they told us that there was going to be protesters and we actually, like, we, they were saying some things, they had, one or two had signs, but it was basically overshadowed because this guy, I can't remember his name, this guy, he did, he made some hate shields for, for the go in front of the protesters who were from Minnesota or something like that, I think it was Minnesota. And yeah, he made hate, he made hate shit. These things called hate shields. Google it. It's amazing. And on the front of it, it's called. It says it's a hate shield. It says who's the buy and all this other stuff. And on the back of the side, we couldn't see, but the processor could see. It it showed them what they best look like. I got this. A little 2019 Pride God Festival that includes festival program, talent schedule, Grand Marshals Pride Parade. Trans and Dyke Marches, Culture Exhibit, Out on Film, and Community Spotlight that I felt felt like I had to get because why not? Oh, I got this pen! It says us and y'all. And the best thing of them all that I got, that I bought because I could not walk by without getting one because it was like, yes, this shade pen. If you've been on my Instagram, if you see my Instagram, which is really unique, R E L L E U N I Q U E, you would have seen this on that. Like when I saw, I was like, yes, I've always wanted one of these fans, but I've never seen one that I like. But until Saturday, um, first day of Pride. But Proud was really, 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 really freaking amazing. There was a lot going on. Like, honestly, if you want to see the parade live, I suggest that you, when you're on YouTube and after this video, go to type, search for Atlanta Pride, Atlanta or ATL Pride 2019, and you will see what I got to see during the parade. It was honestly amazing. But yeah. The performances, Saturday, Saturday on the 12th, which is, was my brother's birthday. Catch you this so freaking amazing. But there was this one guy who was so freaking hype. Who was so hype and it was irritating me. I don't mind you being hype, but I'm that person who gets really, really irritated so quickly by movements of people and stuff. And especially if you're in my face. Like, this dude was jumping up and down over and over in front of me. He literally hit me one, stepped on my foot one time, and my feet was already hurting. So I was like, I was like, no. I was like, dude. I'm pretty sure I yelled at him, like, two or three times. And then, on the 13th of the month, Dinah Jane, like I said, she performed, and I met, got to meet her. Yeah, it was an amazing experience. After the show, of course... I was hanging out with these two guys. These two got like they, they were talking about how you can meet um Don was gonna come out and back to meet her fans. And so I was with them. But last minute I finally checked my phone. I was so happy I was checking my phone. I checked my phone and when I saw that text message, because they told us the wrong time at first. They told us 7.45. It was actually 6.45 because that's when her show was actually over. So I had to rush to the front, go into the gate. Find the, find the woman who, this woman, she's so freaking nice. She, I saw her last year. She helped me out. Told me what happened. This year, she literally helped me meet Donna Jane. I was so happy because, honestly, if I would have missed my chance to meet Donna Jane, I would have been really upset. But, but this girl, this, there was three of us. There was me, this girl, and this dude. 
this girl was freaking out. She was like, Donna J doesn't know it yet, but she's my wife. I was like, she's so cute. And then I had to calm her down. I had to talk her down from being nervous, from being scared to meet her. Because she she was cute. She was nervous in a cute way. Like, not a lot. She was nervous in a really, really cute way. So it, it was like... I've been here before. I know what you're going through. I've been there with Belle. I've been there with B2K, Tori Kelly, Lily Singh, Tadra Cole. The first time I met him, oh, so I knew what she was going through. I knew what she was going through in her head. When I calmed her down, I gave, Donna Jane gave me two hugs. She gave her two hugs because she wanted another hug after the thing. Yeah. Honestly, if you want to see any of those pictures, they're going, they're on my Instagram from Pride. But except for Donna Jane, Donna Jane and me, my pictures will be on my Instagram. If not, by the time this video goes up, it'll be out there Friday, no later Friday or next Monday. Depending on how I feel. But yeah, like I said, like a lot of times already. Pride 2019, Atlanta was amazing, amazing, amazing. And if you want to see what what footage I did gather from my from my experience and from Atlanta Pride, then stay tuned because you're going to see it in a second. Okay, okay, you guys. So I'm out here at Atlanta Pride for Pride 2019. Um, and I'm so happy to be here because today, which in a few, is going to be the first annual by Pan Parade, and I'm excited for that. And I think it's about to start, to be honest. I don't know, but it's supposed to be starting sooner or later, like around like less than an hour. So I'm happy for that. And yeah, this is my outfit for today, at least for day one. <laughs> Is our duty to fight for our freedom? Is our duty to win? Is our duty to win? We must love each other and support each other. We must love each other and support each other. We have nothing to lose but our chains. We have nothing to lose but our chains. It's our duty to fight for our freedom. It's our duty to fight for our freedom. It's our duty to win. It's our duty to win. We must love each other and support each other. We must love each other and support each other. We have nothing to lose but our chains. We have nothing to lose but our chains. But yeah, like, comment, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Turn on your notification bell so you get notified when I post a new video right away. And yeah, I hope everyone has an amazing day, week, month, and the rest of the year.